Hello everyone. Today is October the 15th. Um, it is about 17 days after Hurricane Helene. Um, we got our power back on on Friday. Today is Tuesday. Um, it was late Friday night. Then we had to clean up the weekend outside. So we started back yesterday on trying to get things inside ready for harvest and uh, hopefully we'll be able to ship out on the 21st. So what we did when we first came in is yesterday we watered and fed up. That was the first day that we really got to really water our beds down and really give them some good food. Um, they all seemed fine. Um, they were getting a little bit dry because all we had was buckets of water and it was really hard to disperse that out. Um, but we did make it through the storm, thank goodness. So yesterday we also spent the day uh, harvesting the castings. I have a video of that because people were asking me how to harvest. So we just scoop them up out of the beds and put them in five gallon buckets and tote, Kobe is toting my buckets for me today. Um, we let them go for a few days and have fun so that they could just enjoy some time. And when we harvest these buckets, you're gonna see big clumps in here. So what we have to do before we run it through the trommel is we have to break all of this up because if not, then you just have <coughs> big chunks coming out at the end and sometimes your worms are in those clumps so we want to get as many castings out of this as we can so we're going to be um, breaking this up um, before we run it through the trommel so I just wanted to show you that um, this is normal anybody who has castings knows that you're just gonna have big clumps. There's no way around that. So, um, especially when you're getting down to the bottom of your bins where all that moisture collects. Um, and since we didn't have a lot of water from the storm, these got really nice, nice moisture content for um, doing the castings because you need them drier when you're doing casting. So this was wonderful for us um, to let these continue to dry. Um, we didn't add a lot of water to these because we knew we were gonna be harvesting and we had already harvested the top layer and got the majority of the worms out. So we're trying to finish this up today and then we'll really be harvesting worms tomorrow. Um, we've already got everything set up ready to go i just need to get it going um and then today we'll also be harvesting more we got the soil mixer set up we've got it wired up unfortunately my tractor is not tall enough for me to scoop and then pour into the uh soil mixer so I'm gonna either have to build me a ramp or take the wheels off and hopefully that'll lower it enough. I'm just scared of this arm being too low for um, filling the castings and stuff like that. So I'll let you know what the outcome is on that. Um, so, you know, and I want to kind of keep it permanently here, so having the wheels off wouldn't be a bad idea. I just kind of really kind of hate to do that just because, I don't know why, just because. So that's what we're going to be working on today is to try to get me a ramp built to be able to uh, mix the bedding and the food scraps and not food scraps, but bedding, the, the coffee grounds, the mushroom compost, and or dairy manure, and cardboard. So I'm hoping to get that going 
by the end of week. I may have to have some help from my husband on that, and he's never off until the weekend, so not sure how quick that's going to get done. The other thing is just clean up. You know, we, we kind of left in a hurry with the storm and was just, you know, trying to get water and stuff done up that we didn't really get cleaned up, so we're trying to just kind of get back to some normalcy now that we have some lights. So anyway, if you guys have not liked, shared, and subscribed, please do so. It doesn't cost you anything, but it does help our channel. Also, um, I would like to invite you over to Mimi's Worm Squad. It is mimiesworms.com forward slash squad. It's a group right now of about 400 worm farmers or worm enthusiasts um, that just want to learn about worm farming. It is free to sign up and join, ask questions, post videos, share your wins, um, troubleshoot, any way that we can help you if you enjoy raising worms. We would love to have you. If you're just starting out, we would love to teach you. Um, so go over there to my website, sign up, and when you sign up, there is a 50% off on the living material with uh, Asenia Andrea that you can get 50% off the original price. Um, anyway, until next time, you guys have a wonderful day and we'll see you on the next video.